morning. I'm Dr. Feelings. Welcome to my seminar. Hug it out. Dr. Feelings? I thought you were Dr. Delicate Touch. Dr. Delicate Touch feels nothing. Lesson one, because I said so is not an answer. You need to learn a healthy way to express your feelings to your family. Yes, feelings, hot, cold, hungry, sleep. No, feelings like anger. Remind you of anyone? Nope. What? <gasps> No, anything but that. Okay, teach me, doctor. Teach me. My dark matter accelerator, Sheldon! Donnie, remember to express your feelings. Ah, uh, Sheldon, I feel frustrated when you destroy my priceless inventions. I roll. You did not just... Hmm. Fine, fine. I feel... Very, very, that's two varies, annoyed when you eye roll at me. That's it. You are grounded, young man. Literally. Hey! Donald! That is a restraining bolt. From now on, you do not go anywhere or do anything without my say so. Zero one, zero, zero, one, you! You watch your mouth, young man. Sorry, Dr. Feelings, but I feel this was a job for Dr. Actually Solves Problems. Don't touch me! I'm highly contagious! <laughs> See? So how about I take that gadget and get out of your fur? I'd rather you stay. And people think I'm ugly. Watch, Stickman. I want to tear this turtle apart myself. in a thin crust, swimming in sheep cheese and succulent swamp meats. Oh! Yes! Ha-ha! <laughs> good luck coming up with anything half as good as that. Second place! Uh, <laughs> All-time champ of the day. Oh, Ooh, baby! What about us, Blue? <laughs> um... Uh... <laughs> yeah. It's all good, Chief. I have the perfect thing. Stupid -o. Way to go, Orange. I love this guy. Come here. Here's a little something extra for you. Thanks. No way. Four unicorns. Get over here. Gosh, look at how cute they are. Aww. Okay, stop. By impressing your guys, you showed me up and made me tick my guys off. You remember why we're here, right? Sounds like second place is jelly of my unicorns. This is not a competition, says the guy with zero unicorns. What are we talking about? Guys, their undersides are weaker. Hit them there. <laughs> Say goodnight, Granny. Okay, rock, paper, scissors for the first slice. Me and Mikey are up. 
It's funny how Raph always starts against Mr. Only Chooses Scissors. One, One two, two, three, three scissors. Rock. No, oh, not again. How do you do it? <laughs> Pizza, slice, gone. Which of you creep boys took it? Huh? <laughs> no! The table's eating our pizza! Oh. It's the chair! <laughs> Wait, Pops? Mm. Yes, and so begins your next lesson. Let me guess, how to starve your enemies to death? No! Today, you learn the art of ninja stealth and invisibility, mm. the foundation of every great ninja. Lights off, Jutsu! What? Ah, you couldn't have done this last week when Mikey cooked Brussels sprouts? That's about a thousand times weirder than usual. Who are you calling weird? Dude, calm down, it's us! Ha! Like you're ever calm! Well, now this angry version I like! Ha! Oh. Feed me! Feed me! Any guess which of these is Mikey's inner self? Angry dude, glutton, weirdo. These are all aspects of Mikey's personality. You got that right, Buzz Buzz. That must be his annoying side. No way! I'm the funny guy, Buzz Buzz. Can you guide us to the one true Mikey? Seriously, this is too much. No, but I can rap for you. For the love oh, of no, my that's dog. Okay. Mikey, do not do that. <laughs> Yo, listen up, cuz. You gotta find the real Michelangelo before his mind gets wired by new Chino. Now here's a primer on our lineup, so you can see me before my time's up. I may seem chill, but I do get mad, which makes me ill, so I try to stay rad. I'm the hungry dude in the mood for food. If you think that's rude, you got a bad attitude. Teenage mutant astronauts pick apart my astrothoughts. Discover the center of my psyche. Tongue cover the one true Mikey. This is excruciating. Huh, the center of my psyche? Do you think he means his imagination? <laughs> Venus Ward Trampoline always cheers you up, so I thought I'd try it on Baron Draxum. I do feel my confusion being replaced by joy. Not me! Mikey, why the heck are you helping Baron Draxum? Baron Draxum needs the help of no one! Oh, really? When I found you, were you or were you not living on the street? Maybe. Powerless, because your soul got sucked out by the dark armor. Wanted for crimes in the hidden city. And who set you up in style? <sighs> Dr. Positive. That's right, Dr. Positive. The one who's gonna turn you from bad guy to glad guy. From sad heat to happy sheep. From devil to A-level, baby. Mikey, what are you thinking? Draxum is the sworn enemy of the Mad Dogs. But he's also the one who created us, and that makes him family. And once he feels like he's a part of our family, his goodness will shine. It's the most ridiculous thing I ever... <gasps> oh, great! They're here! Happy housewarming, Mr. and Mrs. O'Neill. <laughs> what is this? I thought we were finally meeting a prosperity. No, apparently we're helping Baron Draxum get his groove back. Called it. Oh, no. I do not make my famous green bean casserole for my mortal enemy. Whoa, whoa! He's not our enemy anymore. He's family, and once you get some of those warm and fuzzy family feels, it'll crack that icy shell, and we'll be knee deep in sunshine. Check out these fancy sewers. Clean enough to eat off of. If only we had something to eat. Bizarro 
world. Guys, are you thinking what I'm thinking? That an extra large serving of Kung Pao chicken would be really good right now? The professor's teleportal, right? Right. If the professor here can build his teleportal, then we could use it to go home. Home. Oh. Uh, don't get me wrong, Professor Roboto. These sewers on your planet are nice, but they don't have that same sewer fresh stank our sewers have. Meets what stank seems to be coming from. <laughs> okay, Rap. Time to smash your way aboard and make Meat Sweats give you the antidote. <sighs> Mikey, I'm in the tank. What part about solving this yourselves don't you understand? Well, boys, it's on us. But first, how about some pizza pops? Stop eating the poison! Okay, meaty sweetie. Hand over the antidote. Preferably inside some of those exquisite pizza puffs. You look a right mess. Serves you right for monkeying with me plan to ruin my rival's restaurants. What say we even the score? Yeah. Why did it have to be scrawled? Uh, uh, <sighs> <laughs> I gotta get in there. No, they'll never learn if you always help them, Raph. But I can't just sit here. This is for their own good. <laughs> I'd have you for dinner, but you look like three lumps of spoiled meat. I knew we'd never be able to do this without Raph. Believe in yourselves. Guys, Tummy Tello's right. Leo, give me the rest of your pizza puffs. Well, I don't have any more. Oh, man, those really are the last ones. <laughs> oh, my. Those are delicious. Oh, no. What's happening to this little piggy? That must be the antidote! Leo, save us with my jelly bone! And vile snag! Make way! Battle Nexus finalist coming through! That's right! Feast your eyes on Mikey the Magnificent! Defeater of some of the greatest warriors in all creation! Will you give it a rest already? Psst. Hey, turtles. Care to place a wager on me for the next round? I'm the odds-on favorite at three to one. Beat it, Rhino. Find some other sucker. Wait, what are the odds on me? The long shot. <laughs> 200 to one. Long shot? Moi? Whoa. I gotta get in on that action. Hey, Raph, come on, break me off some bank. Forget it, bro. And you can stick your horn in someone else's business, Rhino. Your loss, Reptile. Hey, hey, hey! What were you thinking? 200 to 1! We could clean up! Lose your shell, more likely. Uh, hey! What? You don't think I'm a contender? You think I'm a bum? A cream puff? A lightweight? A loser? You can stop me any time here. I will when I disagree with you. Now let's go find Leo, Don, and Splinter. Right! We wouldn't want him to miss my incredible Battle Nexus triumph! Float like a butterfly, sting like a bee! Who be the turtle? The turtle be me! <laughs> Oops. Sounds like the universal language of, I'm gonna kick your butt to me. Yeah? Well, if you weren't such a puny little shrimp, I'd show you how a real Battle Nexus champion fights. We're sure showing pops. <laughs> Sneaking out and chilling in a fun, totally not scary 
pitch black warehouse. Ah! Ooh, ambiance. Well, well, well. We meet again. Where's that voice coming from? Wait, wait, don't tell me. You've all entered, but none of you will exit. Welcome to your worst nightmare. There is Draxum. Woohoo, yeah! Oh, yeah! Go, go! Hey! Magisaurus, Magisaurus! Ah, 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 ah. Magisaurus! Wait a second. Magisaurus. This guy's a warrior scientist and a magician? Talk about a triple threat. Boss, you didn't tell us you do magic. We love magic. Can you turn Moonin into a bunny? Silence! The magic was a trick. This is a trap. <gasps> Breaking news, you're toast. Never toast. As an actual magician, I'm offended by the charade. I'm about to repo your lives. This is why you never go to New Jersey. One last chance, children. If you join me, I can teach you how to maximize your potential. Be all that you can be. What's your answer? You threw me off a roof. So that's a no to joining me then. Fine. You reject me again for the last time. Now your story ends. Wait a minute, is that Todd? Hey, how do you like my new friends? They are so serious. I'm like, what? And they're like, ah! And I'm like... Enough! Now your story ends. Attack! Africa, pow! And the man! Turtle bones! Uh... <laughs> Do you think Splinter's gonna be mad that we didn't listen to him? No! So are you sure this time? Is he gone for good? Absolutely. Sort of. 96% certain. Robert, you must come back to the future now. You are grounded. Oh, Grok. On my way, Lord Simultaneous. Just gotta drop off the turtles first. Oh, the, the turtle, turtle warriors of legend. legend. Very cold. Okay, everybody, let's go home. Renette, um, can we kick it in the future together? Just you and me for a little while? Aw, I would love that, Mikey. Maybe someday. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go home, turtle heroes. Cowabunga!